here. It's late January 2019. Getting ready to go for a little walk. Taking a little nylon 22 hunting coats. Maggie's going to pull hers on. I've got my Leah dancing outfit on. It's not that cold out there. It's actually a nice day. I'll actually add some more to this video as it goes, but we look out the kitchen window. Nice, clear January day. Nice day for a little rabbit hunt. Temperature outside. Don't know if we can see this or not. It's 20 in here, minus 3 outside, minus 2.9. But a very nice day, calm, no wind. Trees aren't moving. Beautiful view down the valley. Let's go hunting. Here, you can see this is mid January. The road, or late January, and the road is in bad shape. And I'll just throw this in with a hunting rabbit video. But the road is not in good shape right now. And come springtime in maple syrup, it's going to be even worse. Bumpa again here. I'm just outside the cottage. We walk down to the cabin, and there's no sign of rabbits down there. It's actually a very low rabbit year. I didn't expect to see anything, but I figured I'd do a video anyways. What I heard is a cat meowing. I mean, there is a cat living here wild, a house cat. But I heard meowing right in here. You hear the chickadees now and some crows over that way. Out over the tops of the field. And as soon as I started talking and filming, the kitty cat stopped meowing. I think it must be our big wild white cat. That's down the property line. There's Murph's camp. It might be over around Murph's camp anyways. Probably the old white cat. It's pretty wild. And that's up the property line here. It's growing in pretty quick. It doesn't take long for the little trees to fill in. The property line goes right up through these little fir trees. We're going to trim some of them up to Christmas trees. Anyway, I'm going to head back out onto the road here and walk down and check out some uh, some stuff on the side road here. And a quick little update. Just walking by this birch tree and noticed the bird's nest. See a little bit of dirt right there in the crook of that tree is probably where it was originally, but with the high winds lately. It uh, is now down here. Oh well, birds build a new one. Back out onto the road. They're not tracks, but you can see them there in the snow. You might be able to see on camera, you might not. And, uh, those are wing marks from a partridge. And just coming over the top of that little hill up there and spooked a partridge off. You can see the little feather marks right there where he took off here. Took off down the road. It's not partridge season, but uh, there are partridge around. One thing that's not here, checking in amongst the bushes, is rabbits. Walk along here and you just watch. They're all white this time of year. And there is white on the ground, but you can tell the white clumps, which might be a rabbit. And there's a rock in there. Just got to slowly walk along and check out along here for the rabbits and stuff. And Beautiful, beautiful January day. A little uh, walk up along the side of the blueberry field, checking in here along the property line. And nothing. Sun was at my back, so it's a little easier to see up into the trees. And there's no no tracks. A few coyote tracks, a few deer tracks, not that new. But you can see there's not much snow left to track anything on. In there in the mud in the bank, you see the deer track right there, but other than that, I used to walk back on up through here, past Murphs, and back to the cottage, and then into the barn to get some chores done. In through the deer trail, here's the barn up through the trees, and our cottage up in there, and our shed, and Murphs' cottage. Anyway...